If you're looking to make sure that your one-on-one -on -one classes are always set, say on the hour or the half hour or something like that, let me show you how to do that. So I'm on my classes page and I'm gonna scroll down and choose one of my one-on-one, -on -one, which are the tutoring classes. So I'm gonna hood and click on that class. Then I'm going to update my availability. And what I wanna do is I wanna scroll all the way down to the bottom. This is what we're looking at. So what you're looking at here is, pro is your start time increments. Right now I have it set at five minutes. So that means I can have one, 105, 110, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. But if that's not what I'm looking for, if I'm looking for more like one, 130, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna change the increments now to 30 minute increments. And you can click this little information right here and it's showing you what you're looking at. So now people will be able to sign up for one, one thirty, two, two thirty, et cetera, et cetera. I also have the ability to set the buffer time between classes, so if I don't wanna use this 30 minute increment, that doesn't matter to me. I really am looking, you know, I just need some wiggle room between classes. I can change how, what times are available. So that means um, if I have a one hour class, for example, and someone schedules me at one o'clock, the next time that's gonna be available is not going to be two o'clock, but it's going to be 2.05. That's gonna be the next available time because it's a one hour class and then I have the extra five minute, oh not point five, sorry, five minute buffer time. I hope this has helped and it makes sense, but if you have any questions, please let me know and check out my playlist for some other helpful OutSchool videos.